It's a much-awaited declaration from the Vice President of the most populous nation in Africa, Professor Yemi Oshibajo. Today, he declared his interest to make history with all the presidential aspirants in the forthcoming 2023 general elections. He has undoubtedly showed that he is a no political son to anyone. Will Oshibaja clinch the All Progressives Congress presidential ticket? I dare happy say Osubanjo go enter. I dare happy make he enter, they do well for us. Now, what do you want for Nigeria? Even though he's apparently not affected with the contentious Section 84, subsection 12 of the Electoral Act, will he be resigning his position to pursue his political ambition? Transparency and accountability. If you are looking for a man who have these four, in his, in his life, in his character, Vice President Jamie Oshibanjo has this for. The Vice President in a speech, Hart said that he is respectfully seeking the support of Nigerians everywhere in the country. I've felt the pain and anguish of victims in violent conflicts, terrorist attacks, flooding, fire and other disasters. Does it mean the Vice President will be seeking the support of Nigerians to achieve the new 5 billion naira benchmark for electoral campaign or he has already built a trust fund? These are rhetorical questions that may test the depth of Nigeria's democracy. The incumbent Vice President position is sensitive here in spite of the political weight all the aspirants on that APC may have in the build-up to the election.